Hey guys, it's Citrine here, and welcome back to another Citrine Games video. And as you guys can see here, I have shrunk down, and I'm really against the floor here. So yeah, I call this the Ant-Man trick. It's very cool to do, and most people will not know how to do it. So guys, if you want to figure out how to do this, you got to watch the video so I can still open doors and stuff. And I am going pretty slow because I am so tiny. But yeah... If you guys want to see how to make this, I'll be showing you guys shortly. So stay tuned, and it's really simple to get out of. And so just let me get back to my normal size, and I'll see you guys then. Alright, so I'm back. And as you can see, I am now my normal size. You can see my hand now. So tiny before that you couldn't see anything. So this is a normal house. See, there's no trap doors here. I can just walk around. But there is a secret, and you cannot see it from anywhere in the house. But if we go outside, you can see there's a hole here, and we'll get to that later. And there's another hole back here. So if you guys want to know how to make this, I'll show you in just a second. But we're going to make this house out of jungle wood. Just change things up a bit. So yeah, if you can look in my inventory, what you're going to need is a jungle wood slab or whatever wood slab. If you want to make it out of stone, you can. Regular planks or any regular block. A block that fits with the environment in case you accidentally dig a hole that you don't want. A door that matches your other items. And a boat. Now that is the secret of today. So if we look in this hole, there is a boat down here. This floor is all slabs. So if we go into the boat, now you can see we are down here. And if we look in third person view, the reason this is happening is because... It's just my um, shoulders and head that are coming out from the ground. So my vision makes it look like I have shrunk. But, so that's how that works. And if you want to give the effect that you are actually shrunk, you have to go to options. And then the third option down here, which is graphics. Scroll down to experimental and click hide GUI. Which is basically the hot bar and your hand. So then you can have this cool view like you've shrunk. And it, you won't have the boat controls out in front of you. So people will know. And the only reason I have two different holes on the outside is because... I don't know what's wrong with my hand here. Bend forward. Is because from the back, you can't reach up here. So you need this side one, just in case. But if yours is, is small enough, you will not need the other entrance. So we're going to build one just up here. So you might want to break some cactus or whatever is around you. So. Alright, so this is a good area. There's actually a desert fountain over there. So what you want to do is you just want to build like a small house. So I'm going to make this one 6x6. Six six, or 6x10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 3, 4, 5, 6. And 10. So I'm going to make the doorway here. And then you just want to dig out this first layer here. And I, I did notice a glitch with the boats. So, alright. So you want to dig out this area. And then, in the back, you want to dig in the center. Three down. And then put two slabs on the bottom. Because if you do not do this... And you won't be able to see at the perfect level. If the slab is broken, then you are too short. And if it's a full block, it's too high. Well, that'll work, but it's better with the slab. Just this plain slab. It's the perfect height, and you can just see right through it. And so, what you want to do once you have the whole area cleared out, is you want to place your slabs for the floor. But you want to make sure that you're not placing two you just want to place one layer of slabs because you can still walk and place doors on this. So it'll seem like it's real. The only thing is that you cannot place a bed on slabs. So if we go back to our hole, here you can see that, hold on, you can see right through it. And I think this is the problem with having a full block is that, yeah, you won't be able to see the boat from a large distance. So yeah, that's another thing. You want to make sure this is perfect. And you cannot see this even through a window right here. So you just want to place windows wherever you want. Just build a normal house. And that way people won't know. 
And make sure it fits your building style in order for the greater effect of the shrinking. And this will only work in video form. <clears throat> so if you're trying to show this off while playing Minecraft with someone, that is not recommended. Because it won't really look the best. <laughs> so yeah, so you're just going to build this. You can show people your screen and say, you shrunk me, and I don't know where I am now. But it's kind of a cool trick, you know, I think it works pretty well most of the time. So you're just building your normal house now. So I'm going to only make this one three high. So then you place your doors and boom. So you have your normal house and you just want to put a roof down like this. And if you guys want me to make building videos, I can do that too. I know I am not continuing that Optimus Prime building that I did along with the truck. But that's one thing. Okay, now here's the glitchy part. When you put the boat down, it sinks down one layer. So what you want to do is, where your boat was, you want to break the slabs, and this allows it to move. So now you can see, you're, getting, you're starting to get the effect of the shrinking. So then what you want to do, here, close this door, is you want to move away from the area you broke. And you want to you wanna place the slabs there. There. So then, I'll show you what happens if you do not, oopsies, if you don't do this. And where's the boat? There. So you're going to want to break the boat. And when you place the boat, if you think this is this is going to work, it's not. If you place the boat and just go to your area and try to operate it from there, it doesn't work. So here, you can board it, but you can't move. So that's why you need to break the slabs here. And I think now, move. yep. So then, just to make sure that the floor looks covered up, you can't place slabs over boats. So you have to do... You have to place the slabs when the boat is away. So, there. And there you go. So there, you have your shrinking area complete. And now you can just go to the boat area and shrink down and become Ant-Man. So, yeah, I actually have an Ant-Man skin and I'm going to get that on really quick. I'm about to turn into Ant-Man. Alright guys, so I am Ant-Man. So yeah, this is just a skin I downloaded from Skin Editor Minecraft app. And so yeah, now that you're Ant-Man, you can just shrink down to your to the preferable size. And yeah, we're going to shrink down. And there you go, the Ant-Man effect. This makes it look like you completely shrunk in Minecraft, which is not possible without this little cheat that you can show people as a trick. So yeah, if you got I can show you guys how to get these sort of skins. So you just download this app called Skin Editor Minecraft, and that's how I made my old, my own Citrine game skin. I actually made three of my own skins from there. But yeah, if you guys don't know what Ant-Man is, it's a Marvel movie that came out in 2015 in August, I think. Or, I don't know, It's I think it was over the summer. But yeah, guys, so if you enjoyed this video, leave a like down below, and subscribe if you haven't already. I hope you enjoy this little Ant-Man kind of experiment. So yeah guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys next time.